What's up guys? Thanks for coming to Gaming Canada with me. Now today, this is a Wii U episode. If you happen to have a custom firmware Wii U and you only launch Mocha custom firmware from using your internet browser and a bookmark, then you might be kind of sick of hitting the internet browser, hitting a bookmark, and then loading Mocha. So I'm going to show you a couple of different ways that you can use the internet browser button to either automatically load Mocha custom firmware or automatically boot the homebrew launcher. Now you can only have one or the other, so decide what you're going to do, and then go ahead and keep watching. So essentially on this profile, all I have to do is click the internet browser button, and it will automatically take me to the homebrew launcher. just like that. Now this is super simple to do. We're basically replacing the home page of your internet browser with loading and essentially allowing me to boot the homebrew launcher right away from that. So over here I've got a profile that essentially doesn't have the homebrew launcher built into the internet browser. I'll show you. So I'm going to launch the internet browser. and you can see I have no URL up here nothing auto loaded and I have a homebrew launcher bookmark now this is pretty simple if you've got the homebrew launcher bookmark what you're gonna do is click it and as it starts to load you're gonna hit the home button and then you're gonna launch the internet browser again from the home menu and then if it starts to load again you're gonna hit the home button one more time it's kinda confusing but it's really easy so basically I'm gonna click this and then stop it from fully loading the homebrew launcher so there we go, I'm going to click it, oops, click it and then hit start, or hit the home button. It'll take me to here, and now I'm going to click the internet browser button right there again and get ready to hit the home button one more time. So I hit it one more time, now I'm going to go to the Wii menu, and that cancels out of that, and we're going to load the internet browser again. and we should have the URL up here of our bookmark but it didn't auto load this time so now while you're looking at this screen go down to your Wii U and hit the power button to turn it off so there we go I just pushed the power button and turned it off now I'm gonna turn it back on I'll catch with in with you guys in a second okay guys so I've loaded the Pro profile back up that doesn't have the homebrew launcher installed but it actually does now so all we have to do now is click the internet browser and it should auto boot the homebrew launcher simple as that we essentially just replace the auto load home page with our custom one focus camera there we go so essentially you can also do that with the URL that auto loads Mocha custom firmware so then all you have to do is press the internet browser button and you essentially launch Mocha.